this is McD the Beast, and this is McD Sports 4 coming to you today with my NFC North football predictions. Uh, the NFC North, in my opinion, is going to be pretty good this year. Uh, I do think that um, two teams would get out of this division no matter what. So, um, let's see what my predictions say. So, in first place, I have the Minnesota Vikings going 12 and 4. Uh, the Vikings got upgrade on um, Kirk Cousins at quarterback. I think he's going to take them a long way. I do think the Vikings are going to get off to a little bit of a tough start because I think the schedule's hard. But I do think that the Minnesota Vikings, I think they'll definitely be in the playoffs um, once the schedule gets easier. The Vikings defense is good. Offensively, they're decent. Dalvin Cook comes back from his ACL in injury, which is going to be good. So the Vikings are going to be just fine. I really like um, the Vikings this year to make some noise. In second place, I have the Green Bay Packers going 10-6. and six. As long as Aaron Rodgers is healthy, uh, knock on wood, uh, the Packers should be at least contending for the playoffs. Um, I have them actually getting into the playoffs, I think. Um, yeah, I have them actually getting into the playoffs. I just don't. Um, no, um, if they can get far into the playoffs per se, but as long as Aaron Rodgers stays healthy, I think they do get into the playoffs. I think he'll lead this team to ten wins, and they'll go ten and six. I don't like this team defensively, offensively. Outside of Aaron Rodgers, I don't like this team that much. And the only thing I really like about this team is Aaron Rodgers. So I think he'll lead the team to ten wins as long as he stays healthy. Knock on wood, but. I do think the Packers would be just fine as long as he says stays healthy. If he doesn't stay healthy, uh, the Packers are probably a 5 and 11 team. But hopefully he stays healthy. In third place, I have the Detroit Lions. And I wanted to pit the Detroit Lions higher, but I just couldn't do it. Um, I'm not sold on Matt Patricia. Matt Patricia. Um, Matt Patricia. I know I'm saying Patricia, um, Patricia uh, Long, uh, but I'm not sold on him. I like Matthew Stafford. That's all I really like about this team outside maybe going to take. They don't have much of a running game. Um, defensively, um, the, state, the Detroit Lions fans always said, oh, defense is going to be good. The defense is going to be good. I have to wait to see it. Because uh, last year, I don't think the defense was that good. Uh, the defense is kind of just middle of the way defense. Um... They did re-sign that big um, defensive lineman. They did re-sign him, which was good. Um, that probably the best player in the defense. But I do think that um, the Lions they could sneak into the playoffs, but I just don't see it happening. Uh, I just don't see see the Lions winning many games this year. Like they're going to be losing some games this year, in my opinion. So that's my opinion about the Detroit Lions. And then in fourth place, I have the Chicago Bears going six and ten. Uh, they're probably more seven and nine now since they got Khalil um, Mack. I did a video on that. You can go check that video out. They're probably more towards seven and nine now, but I'm still keeping them at six and ten because I just feel that way. Um, they're gonna they're gonna um, have a few upsets this year. The Bears. Um, some people have this team making the playoffs. I don't see it. I think best case scenario is probably nine and seven though, but I think worst case scenario is four and twelve. I say six and ten. I'm not really buying into the hype that much. Um, Mitchell Trubisky, I don't think he's that good. Um, they do have the running back Howard, who's very good. Um, they have a few wide receivers. Defensively, he's got a big upgrade with Khalil Mack, so that's good. But um, basically, if you're the Bears, I still think you're at least a year out, possibly even two years out from really making any noise. So, that's my opinion about the Bears, um, and those are my NFC North football predictions. Comment down below, tell me what you think about my NFC North football predictions, I would like to hear. Um, and also, please like and subscribe, and thanks for watching the video, and this is McDee the Beast, signing off.